I'm Brian Madison with Darren Fancom TV. On this week's show, we are still, as I said, trying to finish up all the action that happened in our bow season leading up to our New York gun season. And on this week's show, you're going to see action from Missouri and Kansas. The action on the Missouri side of the border is obviously going to be with a rifle. Kansas side was still archery. And Dylan Knopp was able to film his wife, Lindsay Knopp, take the biggest buck she's ever shot. I just, I just shot at a stud, but it's it. It's almost like I dropped him, but I don't know, man. I didn't, I didn't see him run, so. Okay. All right, buddy, I'll let you know. Yeah, yeah bye. Josh had a buck deer. Going to get the buck deer. Buck down in Missouri. He left his camera, walked over to the buck. He's guarding this thing like a hawk. Dude, you're guarding that thing like a hawk. <laughs> nice buck, man. Look, he's got good mass. Yeah, isn't that Well, here we go. <laughs> Second to last day, we got it done. Nice eight point, nice and thick. He uh, he's not too wide, but that's what most of them get out here. Uh, ben, so we found us ourselves a new spot, thanks to some very nice people, and <laughs> couldn't be happier. Holy crap! I was sitting in some pine trees. I had a bunch of cows in here with me, and you know they kind of messed around me for a bit and did their own thing. And sure enough, I I look up and there's a buck coming down the fence line, just like me and you know me and Brian talked about. Um, just a beautiful buck. I, I dropped him. Uh, wh wh what an amazing experience here in Moundsville, Missouri. Just a gorgeous buck. He's been rubbing. Looks like just got done rubbing, honestly, before I shot him. Nice tall buck. It's definitely mature. I'm very happy with him. I'm so excited that 
I got to get them the day before we were leaving, so. Just an awesome buck. Thanks, Brian, for bringing me down here, giving me this ex experience, you know, down in Missouri, and hope to come back every year from now on, so. Thanks for watching. That's a great buck, buddy. Congratulations. Ah, thank you, man. <laughs> Seriously, thank you. Now we get to go eat. Yeah. Uh, what? Fish fry and pheasant. Fish fry and pheasant. Yes, sir. Woo! <laughs> Good job, man. Watch that cow patty when you get up. Where's that? Oh man, I just stepped in one oh, right there. That's all right. <laughs> Sweet dude. So Josh dropped this buck in his tracks. Unfortunately, he was just out of frame. He, I mean, in a few steps out of frame. It happens, you know, he was trying to get his, his first uh, rifle kill on film there. Came real close. Now we're actually gonna just hop back just a few days right before this prior. As I said, Dylan was able to film Lindsay in Kansas. 14th of November, 2020. Me and Lindsay are hunting our farm. And we got a couple good ones have been showing up the last week or so. Um, the biggest deer that we've had our eyes on all year, he just showed up again last night for about the first time in three weeks, and he was here about about an hour after shooting light. So uh, hopefully he hit, come up here and hit this scrape tree up here, made a scrape, and uh, I noticed that he had an eye that looked like it was missing. He at least had it shut in every one of the pictures, so I uh, put the decoy out, and so hopefully he's just a fighter and he's gonna come in and try to bully this decoy. But uh, if not, if one of the deer that Lindsay's gonna shoot shows up, she gonna shoot him. So, one of us is gonna kill a deer tonight. There's probably gonna be a lot of swapping and jumping back and forth, but that's what the good thing about the blind and with the wind, it's blowing pretty hard and it's kinda of in the wrong direction for this spot. So the blind makes it work. We'll see. Just wish it wasn't 65 degrees. That's all, folks. <laughs> we got.
You can chew if you want. See him here pretty soon. Yeah. Do you see him yet? Huh? You don't see him. There's no way you don't see him. Okay, right. Whatever. If you can shoot him, you're good. on but he's freaking down that was awesome that's a good deer honey that's one i was hoping you would get a shot at all year
see that. He is pretty nice, huh? Yeah, look at that. That's cool. Um, well, I'd say tonight was a pretty successful hunt. Uh, we were probably only sitting in the stand for hour, hour and a half, and we had some pretty good traction um, on our field that we were hunting over, and um, he ended up coming up probably, oh, 10 minutes, 10, 15 minutes till sundown, and um, seen him come up he actually i thought was going to run away he went behind us and um then ended up looping back around and came in front of us and um, came right up to our decoy that we had and um, took the shot and um, say it was a pretty good shot he didn't run too far that was a great deer and i was happy that we were we were in town we were able to go over there and see that buck he's dripping water or what what is that i don't know it must have been slobbering or something looking his nose ready for a fight Real nice buck and real happy for Lindsay and, and Dylan. I'm Brian Madison with Darren Fan and Com TV. I'll see you next time.